hey guys welcome to my channel in today's video i will be sharing with you how i make my curls bounce back after using heat and hair color if you're interested keep on watching if you're not already subscribed go ahead and hit the subscribe button down below so you can be notified whenever i post a new video all right let's go ahead and get started okay so all the products i'll be using today are by get you some and these products are 100 percent vegan all natural and handmade so I'm going to start off by pre-pulling my hair with their Honey Time and Lime Maximum Hydration Apple Cider Vinegar Cream Rinse. And this product is really good at cleansing my scalp and getting rid of any product buildup that I may have. You can also use this product as a co-wash in between washes. So I'm just going to put on a plastic cap and keep this on my scalp for about 20 minutes. After rinsing out the apple cider vinegar cream mix, I'm going to move on to shampoo. I'm going to be using their Maximum Hydration Luxurious Shampoo, and this shampoo is super, super moisturizing. It lathers up really nicely. I'm usually afraid of lathering shampoos because that means it has sulfates in it, but none of these products have sulfates in it. It has argan oil, honey, aloe vera, and a bunch of other natural ingredients. It doesn't leave my hair feeling stripped or dry afterwards. It just leaves it very moisturized. And you guys can see a little bit of my hair color. I dyed my hair recently and when you dye your hair, you wanna make sure that you put a lot of moisture back into your hair because the chemicals can really dry out your hair. So you wanna make sure your hair is thoroughly moisturized. So we're gonna be moving on to my favorite step and oh my gosh, this product is amazing. As you guys can see, it is very loved. It's almost gone. because I've been using it so much recently. And this is their Max Hydration Deep Conditioning Hair Mask. And this mask is everything. So what I do is section my hair into four sections and I will rake the product into my hair, making sure I get it all over my hair shaft. And then I go ahead and put a twist in each section. And I've been liking to do this recently because it just gets the hair that I've already worked with out of the way and I don't have to worry about it. So I go ahead and do that. And then afterwards, I will put a little bit more all over the twist as well as around my edges and make sure I got the deep conditioner all over my hair shaft. So it is suggested to leave this conditioner on for 15 to 20 minutes, but I actually leave mine on a lot longer. I usually leave it on for a couple of hours. And this conditioner is amazing. It literally defines my curls like a dream, makes my hair easy to detangle. It has all type of ingredients inside that my hair is in love with. So, so this is definitely becoming one of my favorite deep conditioners of all time. So after an hour or two, I hop back into the shower and I will go ahead and detangle my hair. I use the Demon brush. My hair is already in sections, so it's easy to take down a twist and um, just detangle each section. And I start at the ends of my hair, working my way up to the roots. And that's how I detangle my hair. And then I will go ahead and rinse out all of the deep conditioner out of my head. So after that, I part my hair down the middle and I use their Max Hydration Stay In Softener. And I use that as a leave-in. And I just take one squirt for each section and I will just rub that into my hair. And then I will do like a little twist and wring my hair out to get all of the excess water and product out of my hair. And what that does is cut down on the drying time and make my hair air dry a lot faster. And yeah, this is how my hair looks before it air dries. And I already know it's gonna turn out looking bomb because my curls are already defined in its wet state. 
and I've used enough products to know that if my hair is frizzy in its wet state, it's gonna dry frizzy, but if it is defined in its wet state, it's gonna dry defined. Get You Some also recently came out with their styling stuff and their hair liquid, which is another part of the Honey Time and Lime line. You can go check these products out on their website, which will be linked below in the description box. So yeah, this is how my hair looks after 45 minutes. And all I have to do is fluff it out. And then I'm gonna go ahead and spray some of my fragrance Jazzla onto my hair so my hair can smell divine. And I will take a pick and pick out my hair. Most days I don't use a pick, but for this tutorial, I'm gonna go all out for y'all and I'm gonna go ahead and pick out my hair so you can see how big it actually gets. And Get You Some is actually having a giveaway contest going on on their website where you have a chance to win a free styling product. I will put a link in the description box. The contest ends on November 18th. So yeah, these are the results. I really hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Give me a huge thumbs up if you did. If you're not already subscribed to my channel, go ahead and hit the subscribe button down below so you can be notified whenever I post a new video. Hit the bell, the notifications will come straight to your phone. You can follow me on any of my social media at Mariam J. Hampton. And I will see you guys in my next one. Bye!